Welcome back ladies and gentlemen, my name is Stephen, I am a Stonewall Gamer, welcome back to the Ranger save. End of season 3, um, we have got Celtic, Dundee and Hearts, we need one win, that's it, one win, I'm hoping it's against Celtic. Uh, last episode we didn't do too well, we lost both games 2-1 against Aberdeen and Partick Thistle. So we're on a bit of a, a sloppy spell once again, like we did here. We lost three, one, three. So hmm, hopefully that uh, pattern stops right there, because I do not want to make this any more difficult than we need to. Just to remind you of the league, this is how it's looking. We are seven points clear. Hearts and Partick Thistle are uh, in that top three. Celtic are sitting sixth at the moment, so. Yeah, we should be beating them. Um, I do believe Celtic are still in the Scottish Cup. They are. Come on, Falkirk. Come on. Don't want Celtic to get the uh, European place. But let's. Um, well, wait, do you do you? If you watched last episode, the end of last episode, Mackay took a kick. Oh, a kick. He damaged his cruciate, you know, cruciate li ligament. He's out for eight to nine months. So, um, R.I.P. for now, Mackay. You you just enjoy sat, being sat down. I'm using this as not this game, but this period as an opportunity to give Stuart Gallagher all the games that he wants. Um, Zach Wooden's also taken a bit of a, well, a knock. He's got a bruised shin, so he'll be out one to three days, which gives uh, Waghorn an opportunity to... Uh, well, make amends for that bloody miss at the end of last game. Um, other than that, no changes. So we'll go through it, as always. McCrory in goal. Tavernier, Kiernan, Wilson and Wallace. You know what? I'm going to bring on Ross McCrory for Kiernan. I don't know why, I'm just feeling it. Um, Thompson, Belomo, Sheaf, Gallagher, Garner and Waghorn. Um... Yeah, let's let's just get straight into it. There's nothing else to say. There's nothing else to do. Or we we just need a bloody win. All right, their team. Um, what's this all about? He's pushed up high. So's he. Interesting. Um, Munier and goal. Lustig, Marin, Simonovic with Carroll as their backline and goalkeeper. I can never say his name. Agu, Silva, and uh, Meriga. Is there a middle line? Remy and Griffiths up front. So, um, yeah, huge match. Avenge what happened last time. Come on, guys. Get sight. I need something out of you. I really do. I need you to book your ideas up and win this game, please, if you don't mind. No, it's the first highlight, so nothing's going to happen. And uh, we have a legitimate highlight, Sheaf, Garner. Let's bury him early. Garner, come on, come on. Bury him early. Yes, come on. Oh, we could win the title after three years of being in Rangers. Three years being behind Celtic. Well, two, actually. This is the third year. Um, we can finally push towards... Dominating this league, which we have this season. We've had a few slip-ups, but we did well in the Euro, other than, you know, near the end. But McCrory was injured. Sheaf with the corner. Wilson. McCrory? Ross McCrory? Nice. 2-0. Yes, come on. Let's, uh, let's get the cups of tea out. And... <sighs> Epic. <laughs> oh, I should really get a beer, shouldn't I? But yeah, you don't. I don't want to be get drinking. Ghana. Munia's had a shocker there. Yeah, I don't drink when playing FM. It's the same as driving. Don't take drink or drugs and play FM. <laughs> um, Ghana with a cross, I believe it was, and Munia's just gone. All right, just go on. We're, we've we've gave up. We can't be bothered with life anymore. Uh, yeah, 3-0. Leandro with the corner. It's knocked down and the guy I can't pronounce has put one in to give him a sliver of hope. 
Um, hmm, yeah, we've, <laughs> look at this, we've had three goals, two shots on target. <laughs> yeah, it says everything, don't it? But it is 3-1, um, they're not dead and buried yet, they will keep trying. It is Celtic, despite them doing abysmal at the moment. Half time, very good. Wackhorn's having another poor game. Um, do do. Oh, I don't know. You're more of a target man. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I am going to bring Dodu on. I'll put Garner as the false nine. That's that's why that's going to go down. Is Garner already the false nine? He is. Maybe that's why Raghorn's not having a great game. Maybe. I don't know. But 3-1. Dodu can get a run around. And uh, Aberdeen are 3-0 up. So, I don't think, unless Celtic win the Scottish Cup, I don't think they're getting Euro Euro European football. Thompson, Belomo, Wallace. Wow! Wallace has scored. He doesn't score often, but he's scored in these last few games. And um, this has got to be a cross. That was a cross. That was a cross gone wrong. But it's 4-1 against Celtic. Champions, champions, ole, ole, ole. Champions, champions, ole, ole, ole. 4 2. Oh, no cats were hurt in the making of this video. He's just chilling. It is 4 2. I wasn't I was too busy cheering then. Wallace clears. Leandro puts it back in. And the guy I can't pronounce hits it to Christy, who smashes it into the bottom corner. Mwah. Go on, run away. Poor cat. I felt it. I felt it. I felt the need. I felt the need. Um, right, okay. Let's just do some subs. Tavernier's feeling it, so Bowenish can come on. Lee Wallace is also feeling it. Let's Screw it. Let's get Lee Hodson on. Let's do it. We're 4-2 to the good. We've got half an hour not to screw it up. If I if we screw it up now and I've just done the whole Championi's thing and wound up the cat for nothing, I'm not going to... I will, well, he's not happy. I won't be happy either. But 10 minutes in. So 10 minutes left, should I say. And they've got the ball. Christy, Remy, Leandro, Remy. Lustig. He's hoofed it up to Griffiths. No, no, no. He's missed. Woo. Right, I'm going counter. Screw it. We're at home, but I don't care. Hodson. Throws it at Lustig, but we end up back with it. Hodson, Sheaf, Gallica, Bowenish. Go on, you can do it. You can take your man. Chief, Gallica, Dodu Garner. What a save by Munia. It's made up for that miss that he did earlier. The guy I can't pronounce is coming at us, but Belomo takes it off him. Uh, Dodu down to Garner. There's a goal here because it's a long highlight. You all know the drill by now. Hodson's put one in. His first goal of the season because he hasn't really been playing. But that is Rangers 5, Celtic 2. And that is the Championship, rather well, the Premiership. In the bag. Thank you very much. Mm, 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 mm. Sorry. <laughs> Dancing around like an idiot on YouTube. But that is it. That is it. There's a smile on my face. That is 5-2. Come on. Come on, you girls. Come on. Congratulations, boys. These are moments that you live for. Yes, it is indeed. We've not only beat Celtic. But we did it again. We took their title against Celtic. I did say at the start of last episode that's what I wanted, and I think that's why we lost. But um, yeah, I'll bring you back for the Dundee game. Back, ladies and gentlemen, Dundee and Hearts to come up. Um, I'm going to keep these short and sweet, I think, so the episode doesn't run too long. We've won the the league now. Yay! Um, so. Yeah, let's just get straight into this, shall we? Dundee first. I'm more curious now to... Lee Wallace is suspended. Yellow cards, I assume. Um, I'm more curious now to see where Celtic end up and what happens to Celtic, to be fair. Zach Rodden is back, so Waghorn can uh, go away. He's not been great, unfortunately, lately. Now, obviously, we do have... I'm going to use this opportunity just to put in... Players that haven't really been playing that much. So like Zellalem, uh, Holiday. We've brought this new 
uh, youngster in. He is, oh, I'll say youngster, he's 21. He is going to be a uh, money-making scheme. We got him on a free. He's only on 475 quid a week. So I'll get somebody training him and uh, sell him off for a little bit of money. Um, right, who else do I have? Sandy Jordan now because I've got Belomo. Um, Gallica, that's it. That's all I really want to do, to be fair. There's nobody else I'm going to bring in. So the team today, McCrory in goal. Tavernier, McCrory, Wilson and Bowenish is the back line. Holiday just ahead. Belomo and Zellalem in the middle. Gallica behind Ghana and Zudden. Zudden? Ah, Zaka Zudden. Or Rak Zudden. It is Rudden, of course. Um, Their team... What the hell is that name? Uh, Charara, Char, Charu, what Char, Uau? I don't know. Their goalkeeper, uh, Kerr, another name I can't pronounce. I'm not even going to try. Uh, Facey, Kellett, O'Hara, and Miller as in defensive midfielders. Gore, Doherty, Witten, and their main striker who's doing very well for Levy, I believe it is. They've got a hell of a lot of names that I can't pronounce. So. Yeah, um, I'm just going to tell them, just chill out, enjoy your game. You know, if you do play the way you can, you will win. And uh, let's just absolutely dominate it. Last time we played these, we won 6-1. Uh, they're sitting in fifth. I, yeah, leave it to it, shall we? Let's see what happens. Okay, I know I said I'd keep the commentary low, but nothing's happened till now. And Witten has just scored. Wow, okay. 38 minutes, it's the first highlight of the game, and uh, we look, well, I did tell them to chill out and enjoy the game, but 39% possession, three shots, they they throw it in, Doherty controls it somehow, uh, it's whipped in again, knocked on by Felivi, that's a poor, poor there, Tavernier, Witten, White, and whatever the hell his name is, puts it in for 1-0, right, they've got another chance here, McCrory clears, Exeter Bergen, I think it is. Yeah, that sounds right. I've said that before. Ghana, Rudden, Belomo, Gallica, Zellalem. Don't know what happened there. He's given it to Bowenish. It's whipped in. Zudden has scored again. Zach Rudden, the superman himself. And uh, what's going on in the box there? Did you see that? Naughty. And that is a 1 1. Celtic is still sitting sixth. And just like that, it is half time. I'm going to tell them we can still come away with a win and tell them all oh, you can make the difference. I'm usually do. I was expecting you have faith, but this seems to be working. So, second half. Let's go, shall we? Let's do it. Get the first crappy highlight out the way. And, uh, yeah. Right, we've hit 60 minutes already. And uh, McCrory's feeling it a little bit. So, I'm going to take the young lad off, give Kiernan a run around. Um, I'm going to put Waghorn in Joe Garner's position just to give him a bit of a run around as well. Right, 69th minute, Zellalem with the corner. Goes out to Gallica. Back out to Zellalem. It's cleared again. Kiernan, Belomo, Gallica, Tavernier whips it in and Waghorn has come on to score himself a goal. Thank you very much, Waghorn. What more can you say, eh? Brilliantly worked play. Tavernier, once again, as he likes to do, whips that ball in. I really, it would be amazing to get a wingers, which are like two Lee Wallaces, younger. That's what I want. Okay, it looks like we're reaching the end. It is 90 minutes plus now, and this will be the last highlight. Facey knocks it over. The whistle will go. Rangers will take three points. 2-1 against Dundee. Thank you very much. Go away happy. And I will see you for the Hearts game. See you in a second. Third and final game, we have Hearts. Um, I just want to go through one quick thing. We got the, uh, what you call it, wage budget and transfer budget. We got 18 million um, and 367 grand in a wage budget. We are not spending a penny. We're going to get free transfers. Um, we're going to stick with the team that we've got. I'm very confident in the team to get Champions League once again. So I'm going to stick with them. Um, other than that, 
right, let's bring Lee Hudson on for a run around. Um, we're going to get a few players back from loan. So Liam Shepard, who's a decent right winger. Um, and Ryan Hardy, who's a decent backup striker. So, yeah, we'll probably be seeing a little bit of them, maybe. Uh, oh, excuse me, hiccups. Um, but other than that, nothing going on. You've seen the team. You know how it is. Let's just get straight into it, because... I don't want this to uh, drag on too long, and at the same time, I want to put in what happens in the Scottish Cup. Anyway, um, their team, Pepkovic uh, in goal, Sotar, Ozturk, Batisteli, uh, McGee is their back line, Reras, Dijon, Kitchen, and Holmes is their midfield, Walker behind Johnson. Okay, so let's just get straight into this. Um, just chill out, enjoy your game, you know. Relax. We can easily win this. We don't need to, but it's it would be nice to. Um, Aberdeen and Hearts have got second and third, and we have a highlight straight away. Garner Rudden. He's uh, passed it to Bowenish. Back into Rudden. Is that McGee who scored? No. Zach Rudden's got his thirtieth goal of the season and his fiftieth for Rangers. Was it a bad idea to bring him in? No, it was not. Thank you very much. Let's see what that looked like in 3D. It looked like he really hit it. It's a beautiful one-two between Rudden and Bowenish. And it looked like he... Oh, yes. He made sure that was going in. 81 points. Come on. Okay, we are coming up to half-time. Nothing's happened since the goal. Hearts haven't he even had a shot. And uh, possession's fairly even. Garner's not having a great game. So I'm actually going to bring Dodu on, see how he does in that false nine position. It's not really his favourite, but you know, just bring, give him on, give him a game for the sake of it, and uh, start the second half. Let's just get amongst it. Wooden's got the I don't know why. Just like that, we're at 60. We're not going to change anything though. Doesn't look like there's going to be any highlights. So oh, here we go. Right, Dodu's got the ball. Battistelli, Sotar, Nicholson. Coming at us. Can we tackle? Bowenish does. Gallica. Dodu. Gives it to Rudden. Okay. It's usually better than that. Right. Here's a, another highlight. Rudden's got the ball. He whips it in. Bowenish. He's hit the post stroke bar. I don't, he's hit some sort of woodwork. Holiday. Belomo. Zelalem. Belomo once again. Zelalem. Dodu. Rudden. I thought he got fouled then. And that is it. Right. We are coming up to 90 minutes. And... We are going to end this season. I will put in the uh, just a little clip after, just to uh, see how Celtic get on. So uh, I'll see you back for that little clip. Quick little update for you guys. Um, before the Celtic game plays in like two days, so Sarilla won the Euro uh, Euro Cup. So I guess we got knocked out by the best in the Euro Cup, not Europe, but you know. Makes me feel a little bit better anyway. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, last update for you guys. Celtic Falkirk. Come on, Falkirk. No European football for Celtic. Come on. Let's hope. I know this is a bit is a bit spiteful, but I just want to see them decline just because it will be funny. It really will be. So let's see if they get European football. There's a lot of friendlies going on. Okay. Duh! Okay, Celtic win. So, European football it is for them. Damn it. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. That is it for now. Um, as always, if you like it, hit that like button. If you want to see more, subscribe. Uh, let me know what you think about the box being here instead of over there. Um, do you prefer it here? Do you prefer it over there? Do you not give a crap? Let me know. Either way, I don't care. Uh, I don't care. I don't mind. Uh, but as always, if you like it, hit that like button. If you want to see more, subscribe. But, ladies and gentlemen, enjoy.